piece of news that we're going to be talking about here, at least for now. There's still going to be a ton more news coming out today, but the Tampa Bay Buccaneers have added offensive tackle Justin School to their practice squad, a sixth round draft pick in 2019 of the San Francisco 49ers. I believe he's about 6'5", 6'6", 300 something pounds, something along those lines. He has a little bit of starting experience at offensive tackle. I believe he has started 12 or 16 games throughout his time with the 49ers up to this point and now he is a member of the Bucks practice squad. This is significant because the Buccaneers did just place offensive tackle Josh Wells on the injured reserve. He is going to be out for at least the four, uh, the next four weeks with the Bucks due to a calf injury that he sustained in the Bucks week to win versus the New Orleans Saints. And I know a lot of people have been very critical. A lot of people have been questioning why haven't the Tampa Bay Buccaneers added any depth along to uh, along their offensive line. Now they have finally decided to do so with the practice squad addition of Justin School here. And this isn't necessarily going to be a move that results in School getting promoted from the practice squad to the active roster right away. School still needs to learn the offense. Still needs to get you know kind of a semblance of chemistry with some of the other offensive linemen and maybe some of the quarterbacks that are in this Buccaneers system as well so this is definitely going to be kind of a slow simmer type of move school is going to take some time learn the playbook and then possibly then get promoted to the Buccaneers active roster or possibly even elevated on game day something along those lines we talked about Kenny Young getting promoted from the practice squad to the active roster recently you know envision a very similar scenario Kenny Young took a couple of weeks was able to learn the playbook book showcase what he could do in practice and then got the promotion would not surprise me if a similar route was followed here by Justin School moving forward but the Buccaneers do finally add some depth along the offensive line I think Justin School can be a very capable backup offensive lineman the Buccaneers do like what they've seen from guys like Brandon Walton who stepped up huge by the way in the Bucks week two win versus the Saints as well as some of the other linemen that they have as well but you know, the Buccaneers do finally add a little bit of depth here, which I think people are going to overall be happy with. They're going to add some new faces, add some new talent, and we will see how these guys get along uh, and how these guys continue to grow and progress. And now that school is a part of the Buccaneers practice squad, pretty young guys, well, 26 years old, something along those lines. So overall, this is a interesting depth addition to pay attention to. We'll see how School uh, showcases himself on the practice squad and whether or not he will eventually get promoted or elevated from the practice squad to the Bucks active roster. But what do you guys think? Let me know your thoughts and opinions down in the comments section below. I believe there's still one open roster spot on the Bucks practice squad, uh, if I am correct. So if there is any moves regarding that, obviously we'll talk about that in a separate video. Also, Mike Evans' uh, appeal is being heard or decision on his appeal is being done today regarding the suspension that he sustained for week three versus the Packers. We'll probably have a video talking about that as well. But let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you all enjoyed. And I'll see you all in the next video or the next live stream. But until then, and as always, guys, goodbye for now, and go Bucks.